It is Monday, March 1st, 2021, and this is your Three Gorges Dam update. We have several pieces of information to cover today, including a look at the water level at the Three Gorges Dam. Also, early spring rain is battering the region. How much? Please stick around and find out. We're also going to have a look at some of your interesting comments. Let's hop into it. I hope everyone's doing okay out there on this Monday, wherever you may be. And first, we're going to have a quick look at the water level at the Three Gorges Dam. The current water level is 166.7 meters. The current inflow is not noted. And the current outflow is listed at 5,540 cubic meters per second. It is worth noting that these numbers are released by the CCP. And of course, I've still been periodically checking in on the live streams. Unfortunately, both are still down. And the folks over at 3gd.moo.com also haven't updated their charts since December. Hopefully, they get back on the ball soon because they provided us some marvelous data throughout the fall and winter of last year. So there is rain in the region, and some of it's actually fairly heavy to the south and to the west of the dam, and we'll take a look at windy.com in just a moment. But first, I wanted to read this comment, courtesy of Marcus Aurelius. And Marcus says, one outlet that does not have a narrative is windy.com where this data comes from. The rain belt is definitely in the Yangtze River drainage basin south of the river and now forecasting 4.5 to 5 inches of rain with a band stretching from Huaiwa south of Wuxi to Shuzhou south of Wuhu straddling the dam and well over a thousand miles wide. Most are predicting that it will hit in the next 5 to 10 days at about 1 inch a day. By the way, an inch of rain equals a foot of snow. We aren't even out of February yet, and it looks like a real rainy one ahead. Thanks for the comment, Marcus. So let's slide on over to windy.com and take a quick look at the 10-day forecast. And Christopher Flack, I appreciate the comments. Hopefully I have it sorted better this time. Over the next 10 days, it looks like about an inch of rain is expected at the dam, which isn't much, but when we zoom out, we can see the bigger picture here and a lot of rain has already been dumped in the Yangtze River Basin. So yeah, right here to the, and this is to the south of the dam, but look at this, dumping over six inches over the next 10 days. Some of these systems have already moved through the rivers that feed into the Yangtze River. And as we can see this one right here, look at this, four inches, five inches over the next 10 days, and these systems are moving to the east. So it definitely is worth monitoring. So in my humble opinion, the windy.com forecast paired with the pictures of the trees and early spring bloom surrounding the dam do provide us with a bit of evidence that the CCP is possibly lowering the dam in preparation for early spring rains. But that's just my opinion. There are still many questions that remain unanswered like this one, courtesy of Scotty Rousey. And Scotty says, are those trees in bloom from this year? Till the cams come back on, and maybe even then it may be tapes from last year, they have to save face at all costs, right? Lowering the water level, I would guess, to make repairs to the extensive damage it has. Thanks for the comment, Scotty. And your scenario is definitely possible. We're all just doing our best to make an educated guess with the limited information that we have. And I wanted to wrap up today's video on this note. The Three Gorges Dam is more than just a dam in the middle of China. You also have China Three Gorges Corporation, which is one of the largest construction companies in the world. The company is heavily utilized to build infrastructure projects around the world, including mega dams in Pakistan and Africa. So yes, Scotty, I do agree with you in that aspect that there is a lot of face to save if something was to go wrong for one of the world's largest construction companies and for a nation. Thank you for watching this video. If you found it informative, please consider giving the channel a subscribe.